uh, more offense allowed in the first half than Air Force averages per game. What, what went wrong, do you think? What was sort of the source of that? Can you, can you ask the question again? Sorry, there was more total offense allowed in the first half against Air Force than they average per game. What, what went wrong with you guys? What do you think Defensive? was... Defensively? Yeah. It just came down to us not doing our job. It wasn't really what they did. It was more so us not staying disciplined and uh, not tackling, uh, just not doing the fundamental things right. So, I mean, it, I give them all the credit, but it was more so us. Ben, after having a couple of really two tough, heartbreaking games on the road, how disheartening was it to have this game turn out the way it did, considering the first two games, the Nevada and the New Mexico game, were, were really tight games that had you guys in it? Yeah, I mean, uh, any loss is hard. I don't think it really changes if it's close or it's a blowout. It's, it's always going to be hard. But definitely to come in here, come, come home after a two-game two, uh, two span away, Expecting to win, and I mean, we didn't execute, so it's definitely tough. Um, you guys get to come home, but obviously, I don't think it, it would be the crowd or the energy that you were hoping for. How much did that impact sort of your ability to pull yourself up? I mean, it, it was essentially like being away, maybe? Uh, a little bit. I mean, maybe there wasn't as many fans as we would have liked to have, but just being at home, not having to travel, and being, playing at a, our stadium that we know and love to play at in front of, uh, it makes it a little easier. Uh, and I mean, of course, I think we would have liked to have more fans there, but I know uh, these past couple of games we might not deserve to have a sold out stadium. We haven't been playing that well, so. How much do you think sort of the tough schedule in conjunction with not having a bye has impacted you guys, not just physically, but mentally and emotionally heading into this game? Uh, I don't know. I don't think we ever talked about how hard our schedule was. We just take it one game at a time. And uh, definitely a bye would have been nice. Like we have some injuries and it would have helped to heal up, but I don't think we make excuses like that. We just haven't been playing well. Does anybody else have any questions for the guys? Right. What, what, what wasn't working on offense? Keenan, what, what wasn't working on, on offense you know, for you guys just to not, not, not get it going? But. Offensively, I just, I just feel we weren't playing you know, confidently yet. You know, it just everything comes down to our own execution. Like, it's not like they were like completely shutting us down. I just feel that, you know, we didn't make plays when we had the, op the opportunities to make plays. You know, we didn't capitalize on you know, pretty much our execution. You know, it just came down to that. I just feel you know, if we can execute and not worry about what the defense is doing and just worry about what we need to do and how we need to do it, I think we would do better but for tonight I just feel you know our execution wasn't wasn't where it needed to be and you know that's just how we, I think that's just how we lost. At this point in the season how do you think you get that back on track is that something you guys can can fix how do you go about doing that do you think? Oh, me personally I don't think there's a there's like a magic trick or any like miracle way to do it. I feel, you know, we just got to take it day by day, you know, just we have to like stick together, you know, bad things happen. We are, we're faced with adversity and we can either, you know, take it and deal with it and find a way to get through it. Or we can just, you know, stick our heads in the sand, and, you know, start blaming, pointing the finger. So really we just need to f just find, find our way, find what we, we can do, what, works for us to really get us out of this, this slum.